Hello, welcome back again to NX Tutorial. So in this video tutorial, it will explain how to create symmetric jog geometry using reference curve. Let's notice this picture. We have a base step with holes and a reference curve created on this datum with the offset distance. And then later we will use this curves as a reference to create a jog geometry, a symmetric geometry. Now for the tutorial goal, in this example we will learn how to use jog command and knowing jog properties affecting the final result. In this example we have an existing geometry, we have a tab, we have a simple hole on this tab and also I already prepare a datum plane and create a sketch on the datum plane. We have a two curve in here, two separated curve. So now we're going to create a job. We can select curve, a single curve, the curve that I already create in the sketch and then select face, face of the sheet metal itself. Now in here, we can see the arrow direction. We can change the arrow direction and see the effect using the reverse side. Notice in here, the jog direction also change. For the height, we can change the height And then for the height reference, we can select the height inside reference or outside reference. And for the material also, we can change from material inside to material outside or band outside. In this case, we're going to use material inside. Click apply. For the second job, use the other curve and then select the same face now we can change the shape by using the first side now we have a symmetric choke between the left and the right with the same height 55 or we can change the height also So that's it, how to create a job using job command. 